What's going on everybody? This is ANA Hobbies. I'm Corey and welcome to today's video. Today is a very special day. It is June 21st, 2020, the first day of summer, summer solstice, and it's also Father's Day. So it's a special day for me since I have two little kids. And today we are going over to my dad's place to have a barbecue and spend Father's Day with him. So the Lego stores have been closed here in Ottawa ever since the beginning of the pandemic when everything shut down. Uh, the malls since opened last week, last Friday, and the Lego store's first day open was yesterday. So I'm gonna pop down to the Lego store. The wife, the kids have elected to buy me a little Lego set for a Father's Day present, and I don't really know what I'm going for, don't really know what's there. So we're gonna pop down there, we're gonna have a look, see what they got, maybe pick something up, and I thought I'd bring all you guys with me for that. So I hope you enjoy it. If you like today's video, give it a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel down below. Let's get out. Right over there, you got the Canadian Tire Center home of the world famous Ottawa Senators NHL team. That's where they play for now. Apparently they're trying to relocate the stadium to closer to the downtown park. But for now, it's right here in good old Canada, Ontario. It doesn't look like all stores are quite open to the whole public yet. Some lineups over there. Some masks. Got a, quite a lineup over there at Foot Locker. I'm kind of lost. I don't know this mall thing too well. And I'm, Wandering around aimlessly here looking for the Lego store and I can't seem to find it. So Burgundy, Aldo, Swatch. There it is. Way down there. We're getting there. That was one floor too high. But there's quite a few people here. The doors are closed. There's people in there. Take a look at some of the displays. We got our shark head still. Disney train station. ISS. Of course, the Star Destroyer and the Death Star playset. Manchester United. Fiat 500. Some of the Technic cars here. And over here, we're going to have the Hogwarts Castle. And the Tyrannosaurus Jurassic Park T-Rex set. Let's see if they're maxed out on capacity here. So we have what uh, we found in many other Lego stores here. We have the 
yellow loft area that they'd like us to stay in. And if you want anything off the shelf, you ask one of them no, and they'll come get it for you. So, oh my gosh, they have the porg. They have a porg. I might have to get that. I have pretty much everything else here, including that one. We have General Von Riggs TIE Fighter on display, the Persona Speed Chase, Action Battle, and the 2019 Millennium Falcon over there in the case. I may have to grab that cord that's right there. And everything else in the Star Wars section. Over here we got Ninjago. And my daughter got into Ninjago a little bit, but it didn't seem to catch, so I'm not too interested in that stuff. Down over there we have our Avenger stuff. The Avenger sets were supposed to come out today. And I don't know that they did. I think they got pushed back. We're gonna have to ask somebody about that. Over there we have our superheroes. Along with some Creator 3-in-1. They actually have the pick-a-brick wall stock, but you're not allowed back there past this point here. Now we got a Creator Expert bookshelf over there with some Fiat 500s. Over here we have the architecture stuff, dinosaur fossils, some of the Creator Expert vehicles, Harley Davidson and the Mustang, along with the James Bond Aston Martin. At the corner garage down there, that's a nice set. And we also have a roller coaster. All these sets are sold out on lego.com. We have the downtown diner and I already have the bookshop. Got a few Stranger Things sets down here at the bottom. There's a Lego chess set up there. I think that's a really neat concept. Chess and checkers, Steamboat Willie there. Got the Flintstones down here. I don't know what that set is. Dragon Boat Race. I'm gonna read it right there. Dragon Boat Race. Chinese New Year's Fair. Haven't seen that set. We got the London bus down there at the bottom. We have the Friends set right there. No Lamborghini. I was just talking to the sales representative here and she said they haven't received any shipments of any new stock. So the Avengers sets were for originally slated to come out today and it doesn't seem like they have them. And they don't know when they're going to be getting them. So that's unfortunate. So here we got our Harry Potter section. Got the Whomping Willow down there with a night bus. And some Rise of Voldemort set up down here on display. The clock tower. And this is a set I've been eyeing up. The 75955 Hogwarts Express. I have my eye on that one. I haven't really gotten into the hidden side stuff. The friends stuff. My daughter has a couple sets on those. But again, hasn't really taken. Over here we have the Disney train station. That's a really nice set. 71044, 2,925 pieces. Then we have our Jurassic World stuff. Coming into a little bit of the Speed Champions. Down there we have our Jurassic Park T-Rex. Jurassic Park T-Rex Rampage down here. Some of the city space stuff and some of the Lego City. There's another passenger train set there and a cargo train set. Dinosaur is really cool, but just not something that I think I'm going to get into just yet. 
And we gotta stay back from these blue lines again and ask if you want to grab something off the shelf. So. I was just told by my wife to get the kids something small. So now I gotta find something small for the kids. I really don't know what to get. I'll go back over to the Harry Potter stuff. And for Autumn, we seem to be into the Harry Potter set. So I think I'm gonna get her one of these Expectro Patronum. I think she's really gonna dig that blue sparkly deer Patronum thing there. And I think she'll like the trees. So we'll get her one of them. All right, so my son, I think we're gonna get him that Jurassic World set right there. Comes with one of those net shooters and he really likes them. And also comes with that little dinosaur and three minifigs, so a little drone. I got a fairly big bag here. Get into that, we managed to score some Easter egg promotions that she had left. So we got one of those eggs. And then we got a couple couple of the bunny poly bags here. It's always nice getting free stuff. I was told to get something small for the kids, so I picked up Lego set 75945, 121 pieces of Spectro Patronum for my daughter. I think she'll really like this little blue sparkly deer she's got here, so she'll hopefully like that. Picked up a set for my son, which is I go set 75934, 168 pieces, the Jurassic World. He's really gonna like that dinosaur and he really loves the net shooters. So hopefully he'll have some fun with that. Digging in here a little deeper. Managed to find, which I didn't think I thought I missed out on it, but we managed to find set 75230, the Porg, 811 pieces, sold for $89.99. Happy to find this one. I thought I had missed out on it. Now after having Dio and Yoda and BB-8, I think the Porg will be a nice suggestion to the buildable characters. And this is a set I had been eyeing up for a little while. We got Lego set 75955, the Hogwarts Express, 809, 801 pieces. And it is the Hogwarts Express first train set in Lego that I ever have and I'm super excited to get this one. This is kind of the one I had my mind on coming in. I figured they might have it here but it has been sold out on lego.com so happy to pick this one up. And that right there is my Father's Day present from the wife and the kids. That is a Father's Day present for me to me and some presents for the kids and some freebies which can't go wrong. So I'm going to pack this up, we'll get back to the truck and we'll get out of this mall. That was challenging, that was stressful. I kind of got lost, I got turned around. I had to phone my wife and she said, I'm staring at you through the window and I didn't know where I was and now I do and now I found my truck. Yay, so we're out, we're gonna go. And we went and now we're back home. It's awesome Father's Day. We got our Lego haul from the Lego store. Very much happy that it's open again. And if you guys want to know why the videos have kind of been slow the last little bit, it's because most of my free time has been going to putting this behemoth of a Lego set together. Managed to get it all done, all wrapped up now. And I need to know, is this something you guys want me to do a video on, show you about, or have you seen enough videos on the UCS Millennium Falcon? I don't mind showing you, it was a lot more to it than what I expected putting it together. And it really, really is the holy grail of Star Wars Lego sets and all Lego sets in general, in my opinion. So let me know in the comments down below whether you want me to do a video on this UCS Millennium Falcon. Hope you enjoyed coming to the Lego store with me, picking up some purchases for the kids and for myself. And I want to thank everybody out there for watching today's video. Thank you for subscribing to the channel. Thank you for showing your support. I want to wish all the dads out there a happy Father's Day on whatever day you're watching this. Happy Father's Day. You all deserve it. Thank you guys. I appreciate you. We'll catch you on the next one. See ya.